Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to the Angry Gas and Palea. How y'all doing? We have got uh, a quest to take care of. Uh, it's going to be like a short one. It's called Walking on Broken Glass. And we're going to find out if anyone knows about the light bulb. So we have to go ask p people in particular, but the only person who has a marker above them is Eloisa. So I'm guessing that maybe she might be who we need to talk to. Don't know, but she's the only one we can talk to about it, I guess. According to the law, according to what this says, I mean, nobody else has a quest marker above their head. Where'd she go? Okay, she's going straight. Oh, jeez, that chopper just damn near took me out. Huh? Oh, okay. So what had happened was we found a rummage pile with a trunk in it, or a chest, and inside the chest was this broken light bulb. And we said something about who would give a light bulb a funeral. And it says to find out if anybody knows anything about it. Well, like I said, there's only one person on the map who wants us to talk to them right now. And it looks like it's her. And she's over here. So let's go track her down. Aha! Hello! There's so much to explore. Yes, it is. Did you bury a light bulb? Actually, let's chat with you first. Get that up there a little bit. You should do it. Yes, the Academy of Bidwood. Um. Hmm. Okay, now did you bury a light bulb? Oh, which one did you... What? How many did you bury? Florentine. The guy who lived on my housing block? g g g g g g ghost <laughs> uh, okay. Oh no. Well, wonderful. We've disturbed. <laughs> I had to do that. What can we do? I think we have to go talk to, uh... Yeah, Kaleri. Okay. So we gotta go talk to Kaleri, then. Alright, so... It's a possibility that boy's up. Oh. Yay. It's up and in the library. Um, I'm guessing that if we don't... Hello. We don't really get a lot coming out. Uh, uh, any updates to, uh, to our other quests, Strange Things Afoot and... And Find Your Shep. Or, I'm sorry, Strange Things Afoot and other things. We might, uh... We might just to take a break. I've got a lot of other things I need to get working on. And, I mean, you know, I hate to just keep pl plugging content with nothing happening. But uh, we'll have to see. So. Why are people not showing up on my map? Hmm. Well, okay, what are you doing? The books here have stood the test of time. Yes, do you have a... Do you have your forbidden romances? We need to uncurse Kilima. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't know about that. Oh, crap. So we have to tell her, we have to go back to her now? Alrighty. And we gotta go back to Eloisa. She... She's just still hanging out over there. Fine. But yeah, I mean, I'm sure there's gonna be some stuff going on for... Maybe the December. But this is like the fall stuff. The winter stuff will probably be happening too, but... For the most part... We don't have a lot more going on. Except me just, you know working on uh, villager stuff, and I might do that in the meantime, but not just put out any videos until I'm done with it. Is it a hoax or a truth you have yet to discover? Uh, she said to return your other book. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we got a glow bug, glass bulb, and we upped our thing. And and that 
That was it. That was all we did. Okay, well, mm, wonderful. Let's figure out something else to do, because I, I feel like that's like a 10-minute video. You know what I really should do? I really should fix the damn house and plot, farming plot, because it just it's a mess. But I don't want to do... I've always heard that you should max out your focus before you buy all the plots. And in order for us to do that, we've got to... Let me look. Look at this. we got... 1100, we got 1100 in skill medals for foraging. Fishing is only 10. Gardening is 680. We could actually get some stuff there, however, and that's a separate thought, I know. What we should do is probably go, I mean, I'm going to go blow renown on focus points. Because I. Didn't I did that wrong to begin with? It's like how you know I, you have your your focus and your total number of focus and whatever else. And like one is the uh, the Phoenix Shrine and one is the Dragon Shrine. Okay, why is everything dark in here now? What is going on? Is this because of Halloween, like for autumn? What it, what is happening here? What? Why is this like this? Oh, this is where we came in at. So, commune. So, hold on a second. Okay, I could be wrong about this. I could be wrong about this. But we are at level 70. And when we increase levels, our renown increases, right? Our focus bonus is at 57.5%, which means that we get a bonus for being fully fed and doing things like fishing, gardening, all this stuff. If we increase that, then we'll go up faster and then we get more <laughs> renown. If we spend money or spend renown and commune with the Phoenix Shrine, it increases our bonus. If we inc but if we spend it at the Dragon Shrine, it increases the level, the, the, the maximum level of focus that we can have. So I think we need to increase the bonus first before we increase the... F I know, we did this before and I, I could be wrong. But let's go ahead and do this. So it's it, it, but it's a lot of diminishing returns because each time you use a focus on it, you spend 100, you don't get as much. So we were at 57 and a half. We're now at 60. Okay, right now we've got 761. So 63. We eh 65. Five sixty one. Instead of going and buying all the writs first, let's max this stuff out so that then we can come back and get more. You know, come on. All right. So then we got three hundred sixty one. We have, we're at seventy. It's going to get smaller and smaller as we go up. This has seventy two. Seventy-five, and we've only got one hundred sixty-one left. Okay, we're at seventy-six bonus focus bonus. Now, of course, when you do that focus bonus, you have to have. Oh, I've, I've exhibited traits associated with personality type. I didn't realize that. I told you that. Okay, so what I'm saying is, that we have to have a total focus of six hundred in order to get the maximum bonus in order to level up. So I think that's going to be my marching goals as I'm going to be or my marching orders right now is I'm going to go increase the um, let's max it everything out so that we can uh, you know I'll put those fish I'll chop I'll do whatever I can in order to get the, and we'll just keep going and get that up to 100 and see how that works. I don't know it's going to be today. Wow that's pretty in it. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be today but <laughs> I think, we, you know, until, in order for me to continually do stuff until some more content comes out or until I can get some more content done. But like I said, it may not be every week. We might be going to a slower release schedule. Because um, my, I think my ultimate goal right now, barring any new quests coming out as far as the uh, Strange Things Afoot 
um, storyline is that I want to max out the, those traits and everything else so I can increase the plots at the farm or the plot, you know, whatever it is, the, the, build that up, build the house, get that all done and make a tons of money and all that other stuff. So that's going to be my, my goal. Well, maybe we'll check in and, and, and see how what our goals have been, how we're going to achieve that goal. If I can try to keep it every week, I will try. I can't guarantee it. My, unfortunately, I'm not very diligent, and then every time I you know I record maybe half an hour, an hour before I um, publish a video, <laughs> and then I don't touch it until the next week and because and, I just don't have time. I'm playing a lot of games, don't have time. But I will, I will definitely try. So for now, we're gonna, we're gonna do that. I think. So let's see what we can get done today. So as it stands right now, we've got 19,000 gold. I just got 2,800 from the shipping bin for putting in some stuff. I've got jams being made, pickled tomatoes, and we've got all the stuff here. I gotta take. I've been neglecting the farm, farming for a long while because we just haven't needed to do anything with it so let's uh, let's work on that I'm gonna increase my focus and then go through the entire thing and replant all of this so let's see how that works so what I'm at what, 556 and I've got 50 here should put me up to everything ba boom and then I'm gonna actually sell all of the crops or, or, or make them the jams to their fullest potential to sell and we'll see how we do all right, everything is watered and replanted. Let's. We've definitely dunked. We can't do that. But let's just go ahead for this first round and see what we actually would get. So, if we sold all of our crops. That's all of our actual crops. We get 2100 for that. That's not bad, but we can do better. I mean, after all, this pickled tomato, 34 gold worth, we could get 50, we could get 23 for just selling the tomato. We could get 34. So we should I wonder if it doesn't matter. These are regular tomatoes. These aren't. Um, these aren't starred tomatoes. So our starred tomatoes are going to get the same amount as if we actually make these into. You know, we're going to increase our yield on that, so we can sell our starred, sell our starred vegetables, and fruits, and and make these into something. So here, an apple. Jam is 96. An actual apple is worth 64 so that's there there we go so let me go put, do this here so what we're going to do is just go through put all of our star quality fruits and veggies into the box for shipping and then take all of our non uh starred fruits and veggies and turn them into jams and maybe cook some stuff too and that'll be where we go so we're just going to get well, we're going to get 2400 just from that and our Focus being 76% bonus, we should do some more stuff around here. We did get some. Uh, there's also something we, we can do too: is a cha these challenges. Um, we haven't really done yet. That'll get us renown as well. Or uh, yeah, that'll get us renown. So um, reach fishing level 25. Tales of the Legend. You know, all these things we can do. We'll start, we're going to start doing. Like advanced cook, we reach cooking level 10. Our cooking level right now. How? We are, you know, we could go cook some things as well to get us up there. So I'm not going to do that on camera, though. I think we're going to try this because <laughs> we're crazy. We're absolutely nuts, but we're going to try it. So we're actually doing pretty good here. Keeping an eye on things, but we're getting running out of time. We actually did it. I did it the first try. 
Holy hell. That never happens. That never happens. So now we got these, whoops, we got these spicy rice cakes. Which are 425 focus points each. I can sell it for 123. Pretty good. Pretty good. And that really didn't do much for our cooking. <laughs> so, so that's okay. I have my marching orders. We're going to go from there. Um, we still got another six minutes to get the 2400. So there you go. I think I think that's where we're going to go. I'm going to continue to doing that. And like I said, we'll try to make progress reports on that. But for now, that's uh, where we're headed. So we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.